I mean, he was saying he scored every other time before, but he ain't trying to say that name again. <laughs> yeah. No, he's not. He didn't even say anything. Yeah, he did like first time. He could walk over and say it. Grace Harris. 
buy like a hundred dollar bag. I'll give you the right price. Thirty percent. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
score at the end of the first quarter, Plainfield Central, 13, Plainfield South, 11. I'm calling you.
change to South by number three, Leah James. I think it was. 
was, but I went and got my hair cut today, and the lady that she said she's uh, she was born in, or she graduated in '80, and she went to that. School. Okay. I was like, really? I don't know. '88. I don't even remember that being at school when I was around. But that's close to the I mean that. Yeah, no doubt. I don't even remember. I never really went south of New York too much on the Yellow Road. Because the Yellow Road wasn't anything. It was nothing. It was yeah, a back road. Said it was like, we even took the old on the way here. And she said it was like if the road was always there, there was never anything. On. Right. Springfield Southbound on the zero, and I am able. I'm not really that familiar with this area because I, I, was, I wasn't even too driving, here, so I don't know. Like, I lived in this area, but we're around here, but I never. Like, I was so young, I didn't. I didn't know. What I, was I knew like Lake Street area, so I knew what stores were everywhere. So you know, so that, that took a Along, yeah, that's true. You're right. You're right. Yeah, I don't know. It was always called that when I was about thirty, and then about thirty-one. So I think yeah. this Lake Street, like what the hell, damn Lake, the river. We at one point we lived on Lake Street too. That's why not we were little too. Long. We used yeah. to always go down there and ride that bike trail. You guys live by the. You guys live by the. Uh, by the movie theater, right? We live like. Yeah, kind of an off-track riding place. Not too far from like 80 Angels and 30. Like right, kind of right behind us. I think the house is still there this day. I think so. I have to send me a picture of it. Like on a, on a, it look, doesn't look like what it looked like in the He said, Pat said it was a house. I didn't honestly don't know. I think it's still there, but only because... I just remember there was a hotel right next to it, but sure, I think it's you still there. Yeah, I guess, um, where my son oh, lives. I think so. I know I remember they, he didn't even want like, like Phil South was there, was there, and then he wanted to get back in or something. Right. Is that what happened? He ended up getting back in? Or just uh, yeah, on supposedly. His own? Well, no, I did all that paperwork when I was there. But once they took him, then, then they, as soon as they took him, they were kind of calling, saying, hey, does he still want to move in there? It took probably about another two months. What do you end up doing? You end up back to live with his mom for a little bit? Or uh, I think the grandma. Or the mom. I don't know. Once he moved out, he kind of lost touch. He wasn't really talking about that. Uh,
It's not been the worst, but you can definitely tell it's going to be. She's not hustling on her toes. She should have done that already. That's what I'm saying. Plainfield South foul number 24, Kara Miller.
On your toes! dreads when she gets in and she, like takes a big sigh when she leaves.
profile number 34, Stacey Adams.
could be a lot of point game if she makes one of these. Every day. You're a freaky man. Stop the shot. One more. Smart play. Don't don't get a deep. Don't get a foul because that'll just bring it down. There.